chicken can be dangerous if you don't cook it to 165. And Thermopro makes Temp Spike, which is not only affordable, but it's actually super easy to use and makes it so no one gets sick. This was super easy to set up. Took a picture of a QR code and the app downloaded by itself, syncing up this probe and this 500 foot booster. This sensor has one that's internally on this side of the line and an ambient temperature to tell you what your grill is. That is a two in one sensor so you don't have wires hanging all over your grill. This makes it wireless, easy, and you can track it with your phone. Gives you a little description of how to do it just in case you didn't know. Target temp is 165, picking up the ambient temperature of where I'm prepping, and that's 87. It's amazing having two sensors on one probe that's completely wireless. Two cups of mayo, half cup of apple cider vinegar, a little bit of lemon juice, one teaspoon of Himalayan salt, one teaspoon of cayenne pepper, two teaspoons of black pepper, two teaspoons of red pepper flakes, two teaspoons of brown sugar, one tablespoon of Worcestershire. Two teaspoons of horseradish. We'll get this all mixed up two to three hours in your refrigerator and it will be good to top your chicken off. Not only is the thermospike extremely convenient, it's also rechargeable and waterproof with a signal booster that will last up to three months on a single charge. Also, the booster will start ringing internal temperature once the target's met, so even if you forget about it, the temp spike saves the day. To get an idea what a 500 foot booster is, I could be at my neighbor's house and get alerts. Now to top the chicken with our nice Alabama white sauce and our perfectly moist chicken is ready to consume. Just pick up one of these thermometers to make your life a whole lot easier. I would. Not to mention, it's literally one of the cheapest ones on the market and there's no excuse not to pick up one of these guys. 